Hi friends, my name is Jake. Welcome to Canadian Cutting Edge. This video will be very short. This is an unboxing. Uh, I've already opened it because I didn't know that this was a knife package. Because it says on here that it's from Two Purple Sage Ranch. Hey, <laughs> it doesn't sound like a knife store to me, does it? And on the item description, it just says there's merchandise and there's one in here. So I wasn't sure what it is, but this comes from a new store in the United States called Knives of France. I'll give you two guesses of which country they source their knives from. And uh, one of them is not Canada. So I've got one of their knives. The, uh, I was interested in, you know, getting a French knife because I started getting an interest recently on more knives, uh, especially from Europe, but more classic knives, historical type knives. This knife uh, is a modern version of an historical knife that comes from France in the center of France region, made by Le Sabot, and uh, that's the company that makes it. And the model is the Auriac. Something like that. My French sucks. I didn't pay attention in school. Here in Canada, we have to take French courses in elementary school and in uh, junior high. We have to take those classes. I was never any good at those. Just terrible. I'm already bilingual. I grew up learning a uh, dialect of German called Plotdeutsch. But, uh, uh, oh, that's in Anglicized. That's Low German. And uh, so I figured two languages is enough. <laughs> now I wish I learned more languages. Anyhow, let's get to the tabletop and take a good look at what this knife looks like. And maybe you want to buy something from Knives of France as well. I've got referral codes. I believe I've got a discount code for you as well. So down below the video and in the first comment, I'll leave all that information. So now let's get to the tabletop and take a look at it. Okay, so let's open this up. I've got a letter. Hello, Jake. There we go. I'll read that. Uh, we've got some cards here. Well, there we go. Here, I'll show you. There you go. You can see the front and the back of that card. It's knives-of-france. And uh, that's the uh, Instagram. Facebook is knives.of.france. And uh, a blog they've got is knives-of-france-blog.com and knives-of-france.com with the dashes in there is where you'll see their knives. And there's a few of their knives here, some of their traditionals, but the, ones we, the one we have today is not one of these. So I'll read that letter on my own. Let's see, we've got a couple stickers. Yeah, I'll put one of these stickers on my rollator. It's a walker with wheels. Et voila. What we got, uh, the brand is Le Sabo, as I said, and Audiac in Juniper. This knife is $56 American. Let's see, there we go. Oh some more paperwork down here just these things and that's just the invoice there we want to look at the knife don't we uh, by the way if you want to get 10% off your order you just need to order $50 or more and this is their lowest price of a knife this is $56 just coupon code CCE just like I have at some other stores you can save 10% uh, oh, here it says Osebo instead of Le Sebo. I got that wrong. Osebo and um, let's open this up. It's in juniper, has juniper wood on the handle. The steel is by Sandvik. So look at that. You can already see right there, Odiac. Juniper wood. Well, that's a nice close grain juniper. I like that. And it's a slip. So let's. There's it's sort of a half stop right there. It doesn't feel like a 
major stop, but it does stop there. And all the way. Ah, that's nice and strong. That's a strong spring. You can see how hard I'm pushing my fingers changing color. So if you're looking right there with the pressure, that's a lot of pressure. So I like how strong the back spring is on this. But then, yeah, the half stop, it just doesn't feel like a flat half stop. But there is effectively a half stop. That's for safety. And then get your fingers out of the way and close it. Blade centering is very good. It's not perfect, but it's very good. The handles are pinned on. And yeah, 12C27 stainless steel. Full flat grind. Uh, this blade style, if I'm correct, is uh, the bourbon style blade. And there's no sharpener's toil. Not sure how well it sharpened. It's very sharp though, feels very sharp. Very thin behind the grind. Very thin. <laughs> that is indeed thin. So yeah, we'll give this thing a test and uh, we'll do the video. Here's a close look of... There we go, get the light hitting it right. Looks like a wooden shoe is their uh, logo thing there. Oh, and here it says Le Sebo. Here it says O Sebo. And here it says Le Sabo, so I guess both are correct. Right there in the Ricasso it says France, and on this side it says 12C27. Let's see, was there something else? Yeah, Sandvik. 12C27 Sandvik is what it says right there. So yeah, I'm liking this. I've got a nice sleeve to use with it. Decent hand feel. You'll see the review of this before too terribly long. Check out knivesoffrance.com. Make sure you use coupon code CCE to save some money. I'll post some pictures of this on Instagram as well. Thanks for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. And remember, friends, always cut towards your chum, not your thumb. Bye for now.